So you're moving to South Florida and got your sights set on Cooper City, and why wouldn't you? It's an incredible city or suburb of Fort Lauderdale and comes in at number three on a list of best cities in all of Florida to live by niche.com for 2021. In this video, we're gonna be diving into everything you need to know about living in Cooper City, including where it's located, what is there to do around here, some of its great neighborhoods, and pretty much everything you need to know, so don't go anywhere. What is going on everybody and welcome back to my channel living in Fort Lauderdale. My name is Rob Zioli and I'm a real estate agent right down here in South Florida. And if this is your first time here to the channel, uh, don't forget to subscribe to it and tap the little bell icon down below to be notified anytime that I go ahead and post a new video. I put out weekly videos and content about what it's like to live down here in South Florida, but more than that, I'm a local real estate agent and what I love more than anything is to help people with their real estate needs. So if that is you, you have any questions about South Florida or any of the neighborhoods that we speak about in these videos, uh, feel free to reach out to me at the number below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can and look forward to answering any of your questions or helping you with any of your real estate needs. So without further ado, let's dive right into the video. Okay, so let's get right into it. So let's talk about where uh, Cooper City is located. So Cooper City is located just um, south uh, from the center of Broward and just uh, west from the center of uh, Broward County. Now, as you can see uh, on the map here, uh, things are pretty condensed here in the county. So uh, everything is really easy to get to. So if you're looking to check out the sites here uh, locally in South Florida, you have easy access to uh, the Florida's Turnpike. You have Interstate 75 and Interstate uh, 95. Um, all three take you north and south to Palm Beach and further or Miami. And you also have Interstate 595 which uh, gives you access anywhere east and west from Cooper City. Now also the beach is only about 25 to 30 minutes depending on time of commute uh, from Cooper City and if you're traveling internationally uh, Fort Lauderdale International Airport is about 20 minutes from Cooper City. Uh, you can probably get to uh, Miami Airport in about 40 to 50 minutes and about an hour to Palm Beach Airport so you got everything pretty much covered depending if you want to travel and check out the sites here locally or if you want to travel internationally uh, from Cooper City. Now Cooper City is uh, probably one of the smaller uh, cities here in uh, Broward County. It has a population of around 35,000 people and it's a very family oriented neighborhood and one of the main reasons for that is that Cooper City has an amazing school system. Now all the schools here in Cooper City whether it's elementary, um, middle school or high school rate very highly. They're on a scale of 1 to 10 they rate between 8 and 10. Uh, and this includes uh, public and private schools. So really, it's, a, it's an excellent school system. Also, according to the statistics, Cooper City is a very safe city and has a very, very low crime rate as compared to the national average, which also makes it very, very popular with young families. Now, as far as the cost of living here in Cooper City, it is significantly higher than the national average and the state of Florida as a whole. So based on um, an average of 100, uh, Cooper City comes in at a cost of living of 129, which is significantly higher than the national average of 100, and the state of Florida comes in at 103. Now, the biggest contributing factor to the cost of living in any area is housing, and uh, Cooper City comes in at 171, which is, again, significantly higher than the national 
average of uh, 100 and also a lot higher than the state of Florida as a whole which comes in at 102.8 so the median home price for properties in uh, Cooper City comes in at $500,000 now as far as your housing options go there's a small mix of condos and townhomes here in Cooper City but the vast majority of properties available are going to be single-family homes and there's a really good mix of uh, ungated and gated communities to choose from here in Cooper City Now, some of the most popular neighborhoods here in Cooper City include Cooper Colony Estates, which is actually the oldest uh, neighborhood here in Cooper City, with homes that were built back in the 1960s. There's also Embassy Lakes, Timberlake, and Montero, which is one of the newest communities in Cooper City, with homes that were built between 2009 and 2015, as well as a bunch of other neighborhoods throughout the city. Now, as far as some family-friendly activities uh, available, Cooper City has you covered. Now, you definitely want to check out Brian Piccolo's Sports Park and Velodrome where I'm sitting right now. Now here in the park you can enjoy all kinds of sports including baseball, uh, basketball, softball, soccer, racquetball, tennis, and the park's most unique feature and the only one in the entire state of Florida called the Velodrome which is uh, used for inline skating and cycling. Now, Cooper City also has some great options uh, as far as shopping is concerned, and I definitely recommend you check out the uh, Cooper City Antiques Mall. Uh, here you can get vintage furniture, um, medical antiques, art deco items, vintage clothing. I mean, just a ton of stuff that you can buy as far as uh, vintage clothing and antiques are concerned. So if you're into that type of stuff, I definitely recommend you check out the Cooper City Antique Mall. Now, as far as dining, Cooper City has some great uh, options and variety, but for a fun night out with the family, um, I absolutely absolutely recommend you check out The Melting Pod. Now this place is a really, really cool fondue uh, restaurant. Again, very unique. I think I've only had fondue like twice in my whole life, but just something uh, about sitting around the table with the family all sharing the same pot and eating uh, is very unique, uh, really cool, cool atmosphere, uh, very intimate. So I definitely recommend you check out The Melting Pot right here in uh, Cooper City. So I wanna thank you for watching the video and learning more about the great city of Cooper City. And speaking of Cooper City or anywhere here in South Florida, I would absolutely love to help you with your real estate needs or to help you find that perfect place you might be thinking of moving to or just want to go see. But again, in order to do that, you got to reach out. So my information will be popping up down again below. You can reach me 24-7. I look forward to hearing from you and answering any questions you might have or helping you with your real estate needs. And until the next video, thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.